Greetings, my YouTube friends. This is Guru Too Cool bringing you the People's Connection. Thank you for joining. Happy Independence Day, July 4th, 2016. Today's topic is going to be about what does 4th of July mean to the slave. But specifically, we're going to talk about what does 4th of July mean to Frederick Douglass, since he is the one who answered the question. Let's get to the story. Conscience of the nation must be roused. The propriety of the nation must be startled. The hypocrisy of the nation must be exposed. And its crimes against God and man must be denounced. What to the American slave is your 4th of July? I answer, a day that reveals to him more than all other days of the year the gross injustice and cruelty to which he is the constant victim. To him, your celebration is a sham. Your boasted liberty an unholy license, your national greatness swelling vanity. Your sounds of rejoicing are empty and heartless, your shouts of liberty and equality hollow mocked. Your prayers and hymns, your sermons and thanksgivings, with all your religious parade and solemnity are to him mere bombast, fraud, deception, a thin veil to cover up crimes which would disgrace a nation of savages. There is not a nation of the earth guilty of practices more shocking and bloody than are the people of these United States at this very hour. Go search where you will. Roam through all the monarchies and despotisms of the old world. Travel through South America. Search out every abuse, and when you have found the last, lay your facts by the side of the everyday practices of this nation, and you will say with me that, for revolting barbarity and shameless hypocrisy, America reigns without a rival. The speech by Frederick Douglass was done on July 4th, 1852. And as you heard from what he said, those principles still apply today in 2016. What a shame. What a shame. Nonetheless, people asked Frederick Douglass, an abolitionist at the time, about what July 4th meant to him. And his response was perfect. When the Union was upholding slavery at the time where his fellow man was enslaved, he had no other choice but to deliver a fierce speech to power for those who asked him dared ask him the question what does Independence Day mean to a black man he responded accordingly I hope you got something out of this message I hope you share this video I hope you give it a thumbs up and or I hope you leave a comment if you haven't subscribed already please take a moment to subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate your support. This is Guru Too Cool. Again, happy Independence Day 2016. I hope this gives you a new perspective on what July 4th means and what it should mean to you. Thanks again for watching. This is Guru Too Cool bringing you the people's connection. Peace out.